Don't even think about it. Shepard, he's going to kill us all! That remains to be seen. I mean, Utina, he's staging a coup. He's got the other counselors now to hand over to Cerberus. Three on one, pal. It's over. No. No, it's fun. How bad is it? I have time. Catch him. Shepard, what's going on up there? Thane needs medical help fast, and I need to take care of an assassin. He must be going after the rest of the Council. Get the word out. Odina's trying to seize power. I've got to get to the Counselors. They're being taken to a shuttle pad on the Presidium. Start driving. I'll try to raise them on the comm. Good work, Bailey. We're almost there. Oops. Hello. Not aware of that.
They're all dead. Get back up. Ah! I'm gonna need more meta gel soon. Shalmar Plaza. Where's the council? In an elevator. They're trying to get to the shuttle dock. Someone's following them. Someone with a sword. Great. so hard to get out of the way. Okay. It's a little too rough. I hope somebody gets that reference. <laughs> Run into that elevator, dude. That would have been dumb. Huh. Okay, uh. I'm in the shaft. Hang on, this will be a fast climb. Oh. Tell me that assassin hasn't reached the council. He's trying, but I'm making his elevator stop on every floor. Good. Nice. I found our friend! Kill his elevator! There's a power conduit beneath it! Good riddance! Incoming phantoms! How? Hello! Yeah. Shepard, bad news. 
Is there any other kind? That hitman jumped to another elevator and he's overridden my controls. He's on his way up. I can't stop him. I'll handle it. Here they come! So don't shoot mine. Shepard? I see them. Jump! What's that noise? Gunner! Get down! It's blocking our escape. He's with Cerberus. Just hang on. I got this. Everyone calm down. I can explain this, Caden. Come on, Shepard. Gun drawn on a counselor? Kinda looks bad. We don't have time to negotiate. You've been fooled, all of you. Bodina's behind this attack. The Salarian counselor confirmed it. Please, you have no Proof? You never do. There are Cerberus soldiers in the elevator shaft behind us. If you open that door, they'll kill you all. We've mistrusted Shepard before, and it did not help us. We don't have time to debate this. We're dead if we stay out here. I'm overriding the lock. I better not regret this. You won't. Dina, step away from the console. To hell with this! He's got a gun! Caden? Yeah, I'm good. We're not. The door! Bailey? Made it as fast as we could, Shepard. Looks like you uh, took care of things. Something's not right. You said Cerberus was targeting us. Where did their soldiers go? Cerberus was right here, but they beat feet into the Keeper Tunnels when they figured out we were coming. Sorry, Counselor, I'll say it plain. Shepard just saved the lot of you. And you have saved my life twice now, Shepard. I owe you both a personal debt, and one on behalf of Palavan. You don't owe me anything, Counselor. In times like this, we all stand together. Commander, do you have any idea why the elusive man would do this? No, I don't. But I plan to find out. All right, people. Principals are evacuated. We got a tunnel and a million more places to secure. Move it. I'm assuming someone's supposed to be there. Yes? Things didn't go as planned. The Council's still in control of the Citadel and Udina's dead. Udina was expendable. Now what? There are other plans in motion. I'll fill you in when you return. I'm surprised you let Shepard get the better of you, Ling. It won't happen again. Hmm. We'll see. We looked over every centimeter of those tunnels, Shepard. Your Cerberus pal is made out of smoke and mirrors. He likes to fight. He'll show up again. Pardon me if I'm not reassured by that. 
We can't even get an ID on him. He released a VI into the Citadel system that erased footage of him wherever he went. I guess he didn't trust that Adina's plan would come together. That reminds me, we got your friend Thane into Huerta Memorial. He's in for surgery. Apparently, uh, there's complications. I'll get on it. Oh, and you can tell him the Salarian counselor says he's a hero. It just, uh, I don't know, make things easier for him. Y'all mind give me, giving me all of the weapons in the other room I want so I can help fight this war? Just for free? Just saying? I want them. The pal- ooh, the door's closed. No huge surprise there. I want the Paladin, and I want the Black Widow. My wife was just sent back to active duty, and I'm about to get shipped out too. I was told you might be able to help me. Of course. You're a Neota spouse, correct? I- yes! How did you know that? We keep identity information on all permanent Citadel residents engaged in formal relationships with Asari. That way, should anyone require diplomatic aid, we can ensure prompt assistance. That's wonderful! Then you can help me send my daughter back to my wife's family? I, I'm afraid, however, that might be a bit difficult. Why is somebody helping somebody else with, like, little clothes on? That's very unprofessional. Good lord, this whole place has changed. I don't know who's talking, but I'm listening in on their conversation. I think it's her. The darker blue Solarian. Elcor! What's up, man? I don't blame them for having guards everywhere. These people went in. Hanar's gone. Thank you again, Earth. Yeah. Never mind. You look distraught, I guess. I don't know. On the phone? More than likely. Okay, hospital. Spectre status recognized? I don't recall it saying that before. Now arriving at Huerta no, Memorial Hospital. We're low on metagel and synthetic blood, and we don't have enough volunteers. If we could get the rings of a loon from the Salian Nebula, we could declare a cultural crisis. People would have to listen. No, they're not just symbolic. The Asari revere a loon. She wore these rings after learning medicine from a Thame herself. She was like a Jalatress for your people. If we displayed the rings, we'd get more Asari support in the hospitals. How's it going over here? Anything? Welcome In to there? Serta. Metagel. I think I'll buy that. 25,000. coming to Serta. How can we help you? All right. Be safe. So you went back to the farm. We snuck down the hill. We were hungry, filthy. I turned the towel into a kind of tunic. They'd cleaned up the bodies to make more husks, I figured. But there were still farmers alive. They were being held prisoner. And Neira was there, directing the other forces. I could see her. I, I got within ten meters of her. I just had my gun. What happened next? I got to the prisoners. The farm girl unlocked their restraints, and that's when they all started screaming. Like they were indoctrinated. I don't know, I could be horribly wrong on that, but it seems like it was leaning that way. God, this place is completely different. It's awesome. I mean, it's There's not got awesome. to be something. I don't know what Cerberus was packing, but we're going to lose this patient. Without a new treatment plan, we're stuck, and I can't think of anything beyond what we've already tried. I know, but I can't think of anything else. Can you? Pardon me? I 
understand Palavin is very busy, but this is one of your own generals. He was stabbed with a poison blade by a Cerberus soldier during the attack on the Citadel. We can't identify the toxin. We're barely keeping him alive right now. It's some form of neurotoxin. If you could look at our charts... Of course. The general is just on Who are we to choose who lives or dies? It's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position to survive. If we take care of them first and ration our supplies, we can save some now and enable ourselves to save more later. We cannot do that. We swore an oath to help the sick regardless of their economic situations or their places in society. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. We're fighting right now to protect the people you're talking about. If you let these people die, that fight is for nothing. It's not that simple. If we aren't careful about this now, we'll end up losing everyone. Then we'll find a way. Look, we have more fortunate patients, right? Yes. And I hate to say it, but the fortunate ones have far better survival odds. <laughs> and more credits. So we ask them for donations. To get more supplies. For those without credits. What? Are you saying what I think you're saying? That's... You know, that, that actually might work. Sorry. Lack of talking. Probably disturbing to some. Not to me. Can I help you? I'm looking for a drell named Thane Krios. Well, we have a drell, but not under that name. He was injured. Stab wound. He's a regular patient here. It's all right, it's all right. I see. The doctors were able to repair a lot of the trauma. However, Mr. Hmm. Krios is in the final stages of Keppel Syndrome. At its worst, Keppel Syndrome interferes with his blood's ability to carry oxygen. And he lost a lot. Now, they've given him transfusions, but frankly, there was a very limited supply of Drell blood on the Citadel. Is he still alive or not? Mr. Creo slips in and out of consciousness, and the outlook isn't good. It's hard to tell how much time he has. When he's awake, he's pretty lucid, never forgets anything. I think that helps. His son, Koliat, he's in there saying his goodbyes. You might want to say yours. Commander Shepard, my father mentioned you were no longer incarcerated. I don't know if you remember me. I'm Koliak Krios. I came to donate blood and, well, he asked me to take off his oxygen mask so he could be comfortable. I don't think it will be very long. Your father helped me save a lot of lives. I'd like to be here. Of course. Commander, I'm afraid I won't be joining you again. You've done more than enough, Thane. That assassin should be embarrassed. A terminally ill Drell managed to stop him from reaching his target. <laughs> I'll pass the word along. There's something I must do before it gets worse. I must... Kalahira, mistress of inscrutable depths, I ask forgiveness. Kalahira, whose waves wear down stone and sand. <coughs> Kalahira, wash the sins from this one and set him on the distant shore of the infinite spirit. <coughs> Kolyad, you speak as the priests do. You have been spending time with them. I brought a prayer book. Commander, would you care to join me? Kalahira, 
This one's heart is pure, but beset by wickedness and contention. Guide this one to where the traveler never tires, the lover never leaves, the hungry never starve. Guide this one, Kavahira, and he will be a companion to you as he was to me. yet? There's something I don't understand. His last moments were those of a hero. Why pray for salvation? The prayer was not for him, Commander. He has already asked forgiveness for the lives he has taken. His wish was for you. Goodbye, Thane. You won't be alone long. See, it's this kind of stuff. How do you comment after something like that? Man, I don't know. I haven't read any of the hate comments about the end of this game, other than people hated it. But, uh, how could you hate the end of a game, or the end of a story, that carries you along? Are highlighted on the elevator. Will you menu. shut up? One moment, please. God. How could you hate the end of a series or the end of a specific storyline that took now you through all this emotion? It's crazy. You do not understand. The code of the ancients is the collected wisdom of our people. With overwhelming sadness, it was lost when the Without it, we lack the guidance we need. With certainty, we need the wisdom of our ancestors in these trying times. How's the head? Good. Concussion's almost gone. Good. When I heard you were injured. It was stupid. I should have ducked when that wall came down. Something good has come out of all this, though. Got new equipment. Sent me a set of Vortex armor. Man, summoning supplies sure messed that one up. Oh, I've heard those are pretty good. It's great. I'd only be safer inside a tank. That's why Vortex gear costs more than I make in a year. Hmm. Vortex gear. I'll try to remember that. I don't know if I'll get a Solarian on my team again, but if I do... I shall try to obtain a set for him. Or her. The is that our people are terrible at making war. The library at Asha had sacred texts on the ways of the hunters. The defining works on the art of battle. But the Nimbus cluster has already fallen, and our people are here dancing instead of fighting. I have to agree. Ugh. This sucks. What have you got there? Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They've got us spread out across alliance units. Reinforcing barriers, modding ammo, that kind of thing. How are they holding up? They are fine. They're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore leave. Complain if you like, but I think military life suits you. Hey, running back to the alliance was your lifelong dream, not mine. Come on, plenty of combat, free room and board, and people you can depend on. Yeah, yeah. Maybe your little suicide squad taught me something about teamwork. Speaking of which, thanks. My guys are handling the support stuff well. Still see some action, but they're not on the front lines. They've saved a lot of lives. It'd be a hell of a lot more fun with you. You find bigger fights. But the little shits are useless without me. I gotta stick with them. Cause I'm dependable now, apparently. 
I blame you for this, Shepard. Come on. What? The duty rosters can wait. Right now, you're on shore leave. <laughs> Shepard, everybody knows you can't dance. Word. is a flexible biomimetic nanomaterial over a metallic skull. The skin uses sheer thickening technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. However, for infiltration purposes, it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it. Huh. You're dancing with the wall. Oh. Oh. I see what it wants me to do there. Awkward. Again. Nope, y'all right creep you guys out again, just... Well, you're welcome. <laughs> the banner of the first regiment. Oh. Hey! How'd you get in here? Look at this! All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war! How is this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing, this is forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. If a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? Watching from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over-the-clothes action? That's always a risk. But then so are the Reapers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. If you could be out there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you've got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Yeah, guess I do. Now... If you'll excuse me. He's gonna go try to look stupid. Good luck with that. Nothing. Oh, I should be able to go talk to Bar Levon now. Is he up here? Yeah. Haven't broken anything yet. That's a start. <laughs> uh, I probably don't want to talk to you. Look who's here. The Blue Suns, Blood Pack, and Eclipse. Yeah, Is there yeah. anything on your mind? Uh, no. We'll talk later. I'm sure. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Same thing, same thing. Not interested. Okay. So, Barlevon is going to be over at the commons. These doors are too slow! There we go. Spectre status recognized. One moment, 